Hi everyone, welcome to our Motion House online classes. I'm Shannon, I'm one of the dancers in the company. We thought we'd take this opportunity to create an outlet for you guys to be able to keep moving in the comfort of your own home. These exercises are designed for you to do at home, static, in any space that you like. So you could do this in your lounge, in your kitchen, in your bedroom, in your garden, wherever you feel most comfortable. So take good care when doing these exercises. Be safe and be creative and we hope you enjoy. So throughout this video there will be some moments of teaching points just to help you get to grips with the movement. It just gives you some, gives you some pointers so you know that you're doing, using the technique properly. Motion House takes no responsibility for your health and safety during these exercises. So please ensure that your space is clear and that you're exercising safely. Make sure you only work to your safe limits, listen to your body, and take good care. Hi, uh, I'm Joel. Have some water next to you, stop the, the video anytime you need, uh, just to drink some water. And yeah, I really hope you enjoy it. Feel free to, do, to learn the exercise and then do it as, as your own speed, like whatever you, you want, just feel free. So yeah, I really hope you enjoy it and let's get on with it. So for the first uh, exercise, uh, it's basically on the spot. Uh, just I'll go, I'll move a little bit my arms so ju just make sure you have enough space to move your arms. And yeah, I'll, I'll just teach it now and then you can prepare the song and everything later. So we're gonna start uh, with just circles with the head I'll, I'll do it with you so you can follow me as well. So I'll, we'll do four circles with the head to each side. Uh, we'll go four shoulders back, four shoulders front, uh, with the plie, everything. Four elbows back, four elbows front, four arms back, four arms front. And then we'll have a little going down to find a stretch, to down to crutch, down to stretch, down up. Uh, after this, every, the music uh, speeds up, so we're gonna start with the cardio, and it's we're just gonna do this movement for for a while. So you just follow me. Then we're gonna find a wide second position and just do four big circles with the pelvis, trying to get some mobility in the hips. So it's four of them to each side. Uh, after this, we're gonna do some swings. So yeah, be careful around the space you have. If you can do them with wide arms. Just do them with the elbows. The importance is that you get some mobility in your back. So, just a few of them. And then after this, we're gonna go for uh, op like an open second. So, don't fa uh, your knees won't be facing the front. Just face the the side. And then we go one side down, other side, and then full uh, other side. Okay. Uh, just after this, we're gonna. Go down again, do the same movement we were doing before. So that gets repeated a few times. And then uh, we're gonna go back to the same thing we did. So a little bit of cardio, getting some hips move it, mobility, then the same kind of phrase we did. And then we're gonna end up with some jumps with knees up, then feet to the bottom. And then and by the end, just a few squats, basic squats. You don't want to go really low. It's just to get some, some blood flow in your legs. Okay, pressing play in three, two, one, now. Start circling with your head, both sides, your own time. Let's go, shoulders, one, two, three, four, front, two, three, floor, elbows, one, two, three, four, to the front, one, two, three, four, arms, one, two, three, four, to the front, one, Two, three, four. Go down, find a stretch. Down to crouch. Stretch again. 
Up. Ready. Let's go. Check. Check. Keep it as deep as you want. Find a wet second. Turn this. Other side. Change again. Last time. Nice. Twist. 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 Nice. Open your second. To the right. Down. Left. Up. Left. Down. Right. Up. And go again. Down. Stretch. Down to crouch. Stretch again. Up. Breathe. Because it's coming. Hoop. Nice, nice, nice. Open second. Other side. Change. Last one. Nice, swings again. Hoop. Right, down, left, up, left, down, right. Ready? Nice, nice, nice. To the back. Some squats to end up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And last thing, just come down. Find the crouch again. Find the stretch. Nice, well done. So for this second exercise, it's just like a mobility, a bit of a stretchy one. So uh, basically, I'll, I'll just talk, talk you like through it now, but you can just follow me if you want. So we're just gonna start with a little rise your arms to bring everything down. Find a little stretch. Go down to crouch. Find a press up position. Just the two press ups. Come down, little stretch with the back. Go back to your knees. Bring your arms up. Bring them down again and just have a little stretch here on your knees. And then we're gonna go to downward facing dog. I'll, ju I'll do it like this so you can see it better. Downward dog. You can feel free to walk if you want, walk your feet if it feels too much, or just bend your legs a little bit, it's just to get a little bit of a stretch. And then from here we're gonna go right leg first, it's gonna go through, and just have a little stretch here. We're gonna go back, and then left leg is gonna go through. Little exercise, little stretch, sorry, to come back to downward dog, to walk your hands back to your feet, and then we're just gonna plie, and then we'll do all of this together a little bit faster. Play in three, two, one, now. Ready? Breathe in. Breathe out. Bring everything down. Down to crouch. Out to press up position. Two press ups. Little stretch. Go back to your knees. Arms up. Arms down. And just stretch here. Nice. 
find the downward dog. Just walk your feet if you need. And we're gonna go right leg. Pops front. Just a little stretch here. To go back, left leg. Little stretch. It's fun. Downward up again. Walk back. Up. Ready? Maybe a little bit faster. Go. So press ups. Go back. Arms round. Bring them. Little stretch. Downward dog. And right leg. Left leg. Downward dog. Well done. This is going to be a basic, really basic tan deal, so we can get some mobility in our ankles, some weight going through our toes. So the exercise starts like in parallel, and basically I'll, I'll teach it like I'm doing it, so I'll say right and I say left. But if you want a mirror, if you want to do everything, it works better for you. Uh, I'll be teaching it like right, left, but if you want to mirror it, feel free. So we start going to demi to our right right leg so it goes demi demi we change so we bring this one down and we plie and then we bring this one up so we go demi demi plie and then once we plie with this one we press the heel back to step forward and step back so it goes demi demi change swipe front and step and same thing to the side and the back, so it goes demi, demi, change, step, swipe, uh, to the side, and back. And same thing back, so demi, demi, low, to step, this, the, the one that goes back, instead of going behind and then going front, it goes uh, demi, demi, plie, we bring it to the front to step behind, and then once we've done the three sides, we do a little round with the legs, so we're gonna pop, uh, poke, sorry, our, our right foot to the back to go round, to step at the side, to change direction, to then step to the front and bring it back to the same direction we were facing before. So this last thing goes round to step, to step and shift back to where we were. And then we do the same thing with the left, so we go demi, demi, change, swipe, front and back, demi, Demi, change, swipe to the side, and back. Demi, demi, change, the one that goes back goes front first and then steps back. And then we poke our left foot around to step, to step, and go back to the phrasing. After we've done this, we're gonna do two little rises, and then find the balance, and then we bring our arms up, to the front, to the side, wherever it feels better. And it's just like a, a little bit of time on a rise. After we've done the rise, we go for the plie, so we go one grand plie to go up, to then fight two demi plies, and then just after the second one, we're gonna do, uh, so we're gonna go grand plie, up, demi, demi, up, down. So this second one goes demi to the rise, to demi again. And then we do the same thing parallel. First we go grand plie, and we go demi, demi, up, demi open and then we go grand plie here to go demi demi up demi and then he do the same we do two rises and another rise to hold the balance anywhere it's that feels better for you guys and then we close and that's the exercise play it in three two one now Ready everyone? And we go. Then. 
then change, swipe, front, side, swipe, side, same thing back, dummy, dummy, change, front, back, pull the foot, step, back, same thing left, dummy, dummy, change, swipe, front, dummy, dummy, change, swipe, side, dummy, dummy, change, swipe, back, hold the foot, go to the side, change, go back, turn the rises, rise and hold, balance, and down, plies, run plie, up, plie, plie, rise, hold, plie, first, plie, run plie, up, Plie, plie, rise, hold, plie, set, plie, up, plie, 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 rise, down, and to rise it, one long rise, and just balance, nice, and down, close, we're done. Uh, it's a little phrase, uh, it has some of what we were doing before about the plie is opening, it has some mo mobility in the back, uh, it's basically as much as we can do in a little space, uh, probably in the next few weeks I'm gonna add a little bit more of mo moving phrases but this week this one the first one uh, and basically I'll, do, I'll teach it as big as I can I'll give some options as well if you have less space at home, you can do it a bit smaller, so there's different varieties of, of options to do. Uh, so yeah, I hope you enjoy it. So the exercise starts with arms going round to go rebound and plie, to bring the arms round to slap. And this is like a basic rebound, so you go round, down, round, up. Uh, after we do this slap, we'll bring the right arm to the front to change the arms to bring it round to the front again and this this last round it's going to bring us our weight to the front so if we do the same thing we go round down round slap right arm to the front change go round to the front this is going to bring us and we're going to do one step change to the back another step bring the weight backwards and then we'll bring so we go uh, change the weight and then this one, it's normally facing the back, but basically we're gonna bring the leg uh, up, the left leg, change it round to go down. So if I do it in the normal facing, it would look like this. So we go front, back, shift, bring the leg, change it round, and back to the front. And after this change, bringing the body down. So if we go up until here, we go round, down, round, slap, right arm, change, arm around to go, little step, little step back, bring the leg forward, change, bring the weight down. From here we're gonna do elbow rise to go down, to rise with the arms to go down again. And then from here we're gonna go down and we're gonna rise, bringing our, our right leg up and our tiray. From here, we're gonna go little slide to the right, little slide to the left. From this second slide, our head's gonna lead and it's gonna go right, left, bring our right arm across on a, on a like a big twist, so from our leg to our arm, it's a big twist. And then this one on twists, so we bring like our focus to where it was before, just a little bit more to the diagonal to close on a fit. And then to end up, we're gonna open the leg, close, open, step, and then weight right, down, weight left, middle. We're gonna bring the arms up and close to start again on the left side. So if we do all of these on the right side, and then I'll go to the left one. So we go round, down, round, slap, right arm, change, around to the front, we step, we step behind, change legs, and down, elbow rise, rise with the arms, down, 
bring everything up to do a little slide to the right, little slide to the left, head leads, right, left. We really twist. And what well, the twist to close the fifth, to open the leg, close the hip, open again, step and then go to the right, go down, go left, open, bring the arms around and bring them back. This week we're just gonna do the right side because it's hard to explain through a camera as well. So we'll take our time to the right side properly and then next week we're gonna go with the left side. You have some problems with spacing. For example, the first ones, you can do it as normal and then the steps, just do small steps. Be aware that you can bring your leg close, you don't need to really stand it, it's more for the hips. So yeah, just bring it really close. Then this, you can do it fine and then these slides, just do a little slide little slide and then bring your head around really think about this mobility with the back and the neck don't think about really making it big if you don't have the space but if you do have the space really use that mobility around to get your spine moving and then for the last bit this leg doesn't need to be high doesn't need to be low as high as you want basically feel free just use this uh, open, close, so we're looking for this mobility in the hip and then yeah as the last bit as I said before as big as you can if you don't have the space do it smaller and just go little if you do have the space just really try and go deep and round three two one now Everyone ready? And we go. Round, step, round, right arm, change, round, front. We step, step back, shift, bring the leg, bring it round, to step go, down. Elbows, arms, drop, rise, with our right leg. We do a little slide, slide to the left, head leads. Left, twist, and both the twist, close, leg, close the hips, open, bring it round, bring the arms up, close and close, nice, well done. So the last exercise we're going to do is a little bit of, a, of some jumps. Be aware that some floors and different houses are, are can be really hard. So this is not focused to do like really big jumps. We're gonna do like basic conditioning, just like low jumps. Try and be really aware of like your knees going over your toes. Just be be careful because some floors can be really really not nice to jump in. So it's really basic exercise. We're gonna start with eight quick plies, so it's like just a rebound in parallel, so we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, then we're gonna do the same but with a little rise at the end of the rebound, so you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It doesn't get to be a jump, but it's just like the, the step just before being a jump. It's like your toes are still on the ground, but all your body's kind of feeling the jump already. And then the last eight is uh, little jumps, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We do the same thing in first, so eight plies, eight with a little rise, eight little jumps, and then in second, same thing. After finishing the second, we're gonna finish the last eight jumps, and then we're gonna go straight uh, to like a little shifty uh, with the legs, I call it shifty. <laughs> so we go uh, jump, 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 change, jump. Uh, so basically what you want to do is not, it's not a big jump, it's more of a little, little jog, little step, just letting one leg at a time going to the front and you're trying to get like a reach but it's not like you want to control it, it's more of just relax it to the front. And we go right, left, right and then this bends and your head goes, looks at it and goes back to go left, right, left, same thing. And then we go right, left, right, change, change. Left, right, left, change, change. Right, left, right, change, change. Left, right, left, change, change. And just after doing this, 
the last change. It's gonna bring us to two jumps on parallel that go change, change, big change to close. So we go uh, jump, jump, sorry, a bit slower. Jump, jump, right, left, right. Jump, jump, left, right, left. Jump, jump, right, left, right. Jump, jump, left, right, left. So this basically, you wanna keep this little shape like it's just your your foot's just pressing to the floor uh, with the right, then the left. And the last one doesn't need to be a big jump. It's just trying to get this reach through the floor to bring everything to close in. So if we add all together, it's eight plies, eight with a little rise, eight little jumps, same thing in first, same thing in second, and then after the second we go change, 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 look, look, change, 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 look, look, and then after four of these, we do jump, jump, sorry, I always get confused in this one, <laughs> jump, jump, right, left, right, jump, jump, left, right, left, and we do four of them as well. So yeah, just get some time, go over it, and then we'll do it together. And we'll start it on three, two, one, play. Just get moving a little bit. Everyone ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Just eight bounces with a little rise. Think about your breathing. Little jumps, keep breathing. And first, knees above the toes, little rise, little jumps. Two, three, four, five, six, and second. Eight seconds, just to play as deep as you want. Little rise, and little jumps. And roll, front, front, look, look. Look, 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 last thing, jump, jump, change, 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 well done. So to finish up the class, I would recommend you to do the, the second exercise with it, uh, do it with me now, uh, just a good way to finish the class. A uh, good stretchy exercise uh, to just feel better. Ready? Breathe in. We out. Get some stretch in the hamstrings. Go down to crouch. Open up to press up position. Drop your hips. Remember, keep breathing in. Really focus on your breathing. Back to your knees. Bring your arms round above. And bring them down and just get some stretching on your back. Find the downward dog. Right leg goes up and goes around. Just get some stretch in your hips. Find your tango dog again. Left leg the same. Nice and drop those hips. Just remember if you need to put your knee down, put it down if it hurts too much. Just keep breathing. Downward dog again. Walk your hands back. Do a little last stretch. Up. Thank you very much.
I really hope that you enjoyed this class and you learnt something from it. Um, keep in touch and keep posted online, looking at our social media on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. If you want to share with us any footage of you doing these classes, please tag us on Instagram or send them in via email. This would be greatly appreciated. Keep safe, stay healthy and I'll see you soon.